I think the first thing about cycling is um, obviously the fitness aspect of it. It's, it's a great way to kind of get out there and, you know, a lot of people who um, can't do running or other sports because of other injuries and stuff like that, they're not necessarily relevant in cycling. It's a no impact kind of sport as long as you're not crashing and uh, thus makes it a little more conducive to people who have joint issues and stuff like that. Um, it's also sort of the first taste of freedom that a lot of kids will get. Uh, you know, the first bike is sort of allows them, uh, like a first car will in a lot of ways, to really be able to go explore the world for themselves beyond just kind of the, the yard that they may have been restricted to or the house they may have been restricted to before. Uh, so it's, it's, it's sort of the experience as a whole, regardless of the health benefits, um, as many and as big as they are. Cycling is one of those activities that is, is always more fun and you always perform better when you're riding with someone else, at least I find. Um, you know, there's nothing kind of quite like, at least with mountain biking, like flying down a trail at top speeds, like weaving between trees is not, not something that you really find in a lot of other sports and it's definitely a unique experience. Um, so not to rate it against, you know, football or baseball or anything like that, but it, it's something that's not quite as popular and uh, I think a lot of people miss out on it because it's not as sort of in your face as a lot of these other sports we look at. And uh, I think a lot of people miss out on something that they really enjoy. So uh, I, I really just recommend, you know, hop, hop on a bike, go, go take it for a spin and you never know what you're going to see.